Hey guys, this is Mama May. This is my giant couponing haul for the week of May the 13th through the 19th, 2022. I do shop at Giant. A lot of times stop at Shop and Martins. We have the same deals, but not always. So make sure you check your own ads and prices in store. And I do know Stop and Shop, your reward system is a little different than ours as well. Um, my shopping list is in the description box below, as well as any videos I may mention during this video. If I forget, feel free to leave a comment, or if you came up with a really good deal, definitely let everyone else know. That's super helpful. Let's go ahead and get into the deals. Okay, so this is the same repeat deal again. The stuffed shells, $1.50, you can grab these. So I got that again. That's a super cheap meal. They're like seven something, which is outrageous. So for $1.50, I went ahead and used some points to get that, 150 choice points. The Snapple Zero, these guys are $4.99. I used two different, two off of two digital coupons. They do stack together. And then I will also probably get back two off of two from the coupons.com app. Uh, over at Giant, uh, the coupons digital, they come off as personal discounts on the receipt, so it doesn't look like a coupon. So Giant, or coupons.com app pretty much always accepts those. So it should only be $3.98 or $1.99 a piece. Um, let's see, the Pepsi Nitro. Oh, let's talk about this real quick. These guys are on sale again for a dollar. Um, Swagbucks has 300 points back when you buy three. It's Crunch, 100 Grand, or Butterfinger. No Ibotta right now, so I grabbed these. Um, so it just makes them for free. My husband is in love with this Pepsi Nitro, so that's why I did this deal. They are the five point freebie from last week. I did find those in the regular soda aisle. I did go to a different giant this week, so they had them in the regular aisle, not on like the end caps by the registers. Um, they're on sale $1.89 when you buy three. So I used my five point freebie. I used a dollar digital coupon. I also still had a dollar printable that I forgot about. And then the coupons.com app will give me back a dollar. So the total cost was 78 cents or 26 cents a piece. And I had to text my husband while he was at work and say, Hey, I got you another one of those Pepsis because he's he just loves those. Um, okay, so the Tide, this is for a friend of mine. They're actually on sale for $3.29 instead of the shelf price of $3.49. Buy three, save $3. I used two 50 cent off printables from the PNG Good Every Day. I did just refresh instead of reclipping it, and it printed off a new coupon with a different barcode. So keep that in mind. They both did double. And then I had a 50 cent digital coupon come off. Total cost was $4.37 or $1.46 each. Lots of other products included in that save $3, but this was the scenario that I did. This week, I did see a little end cap on this, um, the power soup. So I don't know if my husband's going to eat this. I might just give this to somebody. But the five-point freebie. Snuggle is two for seven. Ooh, I don't even know what that is. A leaf. Um, there's a two off of two digital coupon. I bought it, gave me back $1.50 on both of them. Total cost $2 or $1 a dollar piece. The Rana Pasta is $5.49. I did contact them. They sent me coupons. I have a video on all the brands that send me coupons. It's pretty amazing. If you haven't watched that video, I will link it down below. Definitely check that out and request for some coupons. I used two of those dollar off coupons, making it a cost of $3.49 for both of them. Or would that be $1.75 a piece? Pretty good. This is kind of a double dip deal. So the Kellogg's is part of a spend 15, save $3 instantly. Unfortunately, a bunch of varieties were not included. It was just chocolate frosted flakes or regular frosted flakes. So we had to change up that scenario in my top five deals. Now the strawberry Nutri-Grain are part of the Kellogg's deal. The strawberry variety only is what I can find in the computer system that is also working with the buy six, get back 400 points. So I grabbed four, so I needed two more items. So these were the cheapest things at $1.89. So this is kind of a combination deal. Strawberry were the only ones that were working on the computer. So I don't know if you're gonna buy other things, if it's gonna work, um, but keep in mind, that's the only thing that worked with the Kellogg's deal and with the buy six, get back 400. Someone else tries other varieties and it works for the points and the Kellogg's deal, let us know. So they're $2.79. I did go to Kellogg's Family Rewards. I have a video on how to do that. I was able to print two dollar off of two Nutri-Grain coupons. And then on the Kellogg's Frosted Flakes, I was able to get a dollar off of two printable. I bought it has 50 cents back, so I submitted for that twice. I got back my 400 points and then I saved the $3 instantly. Total cost was $7.92 or only 99 cents a piece. 
The Lysol here, um, this toilet bowl cleaner is $2.29 and the wipes were $2.84. I had a dollar off the two digital as well as a 50 cent off of one digital. Fetch gave me back a thousand points for any Lysol bathroom cleaner. And then on QMuzz.com app, I'll probably be getting back a dollar off of two as well as the 50 cent off of one when I submitted my receipt. So total cost would be a dollar 13 for the total of both of those. So a little over 50 cents. And then this last deal is on the soda. You want to grab four of the six packs. They're on sale for for 11. There is a three off of four digital coupon. And then on the coupons.com app, you can submit your receipt. There was also, I don't know if you, you need to make sure you're clipping those coupons when they come available. So they are in your saved list when you're ready to submit your receipt. So make sure you're doing that. Um, there's a three off of four over there. At least there was. So the total cost would be $5.00. Um, when that receipt goes through or $1.25 a piece. If not, it will still be $8 or $2 a piece. I mean, it's still a really, really great deal. All right, guys, so that is it. That's all I have for Giant this week. It turned out to be a better week than I was expecting. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you in my next video.